logo design process. Designing a good logo may require involvement from the marketing team and the design agency if the process is outsourced or graphic design contest platform. It requires a clear idea about the concept and values of the brand as well as understanding of the consumer or target group. Broader steps in the local design process might be formulating the concept, doing an initial design, finalizing the logo concept, deciding the theme colors and format involved. Five principles of logo. Designing a great logo is one of the most important things you can do for your business or website. A good logo should convey the intended message to your audience without additional explanation or context. When evaluating your logo design, you should ask, is it simple, memorable, timeless, versatile and relevant? 1. Simple Less is more, logos that are overdrawn or too on it are generally inflexible and have limited versatility. By keeping a logo simple, it enhances its stickness and keeps it from being perceived as busy. Create a unique concept and strip it down to the most basic level it can be while retaining its impact. 2. Memorable In order for a logo to be memorable or have a sticky factor, it needs to be both simple and relevant or appropriate to the audience. The design should be simple enough to easily recall and convey imagery or typography that resonates with the target audience. 3. Timeless You want your business to stand the test of time. Your brand needs to be just as timeless. A great logo will still be great 10 to 20 years from now. Rebranding should not be considered a normal part of business nor should it become a habit. Longevity is what you should strive for to create a timeless logo. Avoid trends, avoid unnecessary effects and keep it simple. Four. Versatile or flexible. Will your logo scale to different sizes without losing quality? Will it work in one color or against a dark background? An effective logo should work across various media and within different contexts. To ensure flexibility, start by creating your logo in black and white. Using a vector format will enable your logo to scale to various sizes without losing quality. 5. Relevant and Appropriate Understanding your target audience or consumer is an integral component of creating an effect logo design. Knowing what is appropriate for your audience will dictate what font style you use, the colors and any accompanying imagery. You wouldn't design the same logo for a toy company as you would an automotive parts store. As you can tell, there is a lot of overlap between the five principles we have outlined. That is because to create a highly effective logo, these are the most basic, foundational things you should abide by. If you can successfully develop a logo adhering to these principles, your logo will do an exceptional job of shaping your business now and for many years to come. Internet Compatible Logos A company that uses logotypes, wordmarks, may desire a logo that matches the firm's internet address. 
for short logo types consisting of two or three characters. Multiple companies are found to employ the same letters. A C A logo, for example, is used by the French bank Credit Agricole, the Dutch clothing retailer C and A, and the U.S. software corporation C A Technologies. But only one can have the internet domain name ca.com. In today's digital interface adaptive world, a logo will be formatted and reformatted from large monitors to small handheld devices. With the constant size change and reformatting, logo designers are shifting to a more bold and simple approach with heavy lines and shapes and solid colors. This reduces the confusion when mingled with other logos in tight spaces and when scaled between media. Social networks like Twitter, Facebook and LinkedIn are examples of companies using such logos. Design Protection Logos and the design may be protected by copyright by various intellectual property organizations worldwide which make available application procedures to register a design to give it protection at law. For example, in the UK, the Intellectual Property Office governs registered designs, patents and trademarks. Ordinarily, the trademark registration will not make claim to colors used, meaning it is the visual design that will be protected, even if it is reproduced in a variety of other colors or backgrounds. Make sure your company's logo and name are registered as trademarks. If you do not, your money may go to waste. Registration gives you rights to that logo and no one else can use it without compensating you for its use. You will be required to file a registration of your trademark which can be a word, name, symbol, device or an amalgamation of these elements to identify the business. 